What's going on guys? Uh, today I will be doing a big opening of cards and so I'm just going to show you what I have. So I have five brilliant stars, two silver tempest, two astral radiance, and three fusion strike. Uh, I'm just going to do kind of all of them opening uh, in a row because it'll uh, be easier. I just had a bunch of random packs laying around so yeah here we go. And I figured you know I would talk through it. I guess people Probably don't want to hear my voice, but what can you do? So, and I'm not going to show the code card. That way, you know, just in case. Maybe we'll get something good. I've been on a terrible streak lately of not getting any pulls whatsoever. Sorry, that probably wasn't on the camera. So, it's, uh, hopefully I'll get something, but I'm going to be honest with you. I somehow doubt it. Hey, I kind of like that card. And hey, look at that. Weird. All right, so that was our first Brilliant Stars pack. Um, that's cool. We'll move on to the next one. I'm sure there will be nothing in this one as well. I am at my work right now too, so that's why you're seeing the weird background. Uh, I do work in a government facility, so it's kind of like a prison. But not, you know, anyone who's ever worked for the government will get that. Alright, let's hope something good is in this pack. Please, oh please. Hey, that's not terrible. Oh, cool, cool. We got a double there. I'm not mad about it. Um, all right, so we're gonna put this over yonder and continue on. I'm not, I'm not mad about that pack. That's legitimately the first good pull I have gotten in like probably a week. I almost wanted to just take time off from pulling because uh or from opening packs because i was getting so frustrated with the terrible pulls although i did buy some crown zenith a couple etbs and i had some pretty good pulls with that and i put those videos up as well but beyond that i've just been getting kind of frustrated with it but i suppose that is the name of the game and i wish i could have pulls every single time that would be awesome uh but Obviously, it doesn't work out that way, and I'm sure you all feel the same. Or, I don't know, maybe just like the top pull in every single era. That'd be cool, too, but hey, that's okay. What do I know? What do I know? Ooh, grammar, nice. Picture, and who would have thought? Nothing. Well, let me rephrase that. Maybe nothing to me. Maybe it's something to somebody. I don't really know. I'm trying to make this video only like eight minutes long because I know people don't want to sit here and listen to me spew my BS for 20 minutes. So this is the last pack of Brilliant Stars. So let's hope last pack magic. Oh, I showed the reverse. Oh no. Sock and hey. Okay, I'm not mad. That was a little bit of last pack magic, and I am not mad about it at all. All right, we're going to go to Silver Tempest next. I have this janky setup to hold my camera up as well. That's not the best ever, but it does in the job. But just in case, if I knock it over, that would be because I have a really bad setup. I'm using a tin that I had brought these with. So I could do this, and I have it set up, and it's like holding on for dear life. Dang, I showed the reverse again. Hey, okay, I'm not mad about that. Could I be? Yeah. Because, you know, I want the top card every time. Let me in. Okay. Um, I'm sure everyone else is the same way. You want the top card every time, nonstop. Especially when you're opening Evolving Skies. Capturing Aroma. Swab, ooh. I'm not going to say the cards, because obviously you guys can probably read. I don't know why I get, I just don't like narrating through the entire pack. It, uh, for some reason it just annoys me. Um, because I know you guys can read, and, you know, at the very least, if you can't, uh, I guess I'm wondering if you just don't read the cards then when you get them. Like, I don't know, maybe I'm assuming too much. I guess that's a good 
uh, I guess that's something I should look into. But either way, I'm not going to read them off. Unless I get something cool, and then I'll say it like a Carvana and a Greninja V. Hey, okay. That's cool. That'll be like my eighth one. I love having extras. I do give a lot of my du duplicates to my son. He is seven, and he is turning into quite the Pokemon card fanatic. Man, these cards are bent. I don't know if you guys can see that. Holy crud. Jimmy Christmas, those are bent. So my son is seven, and he is really starting to get into Pokemon cards. Well, I have given him a ton of my duplicates, and I actually will give him some of my really good cards when I get good pulls, because uh, it actually makes me happier seeing him get excited for cards than I will. But I've been collecting Pokemon cards for a very long time. Uh, I am 36 now, about to be 37, and I started collecting cards back when they first got to the U.S. in like 1998, 1999. And I have all of my cards from a kid through collecting them all the way till now. So I have, I always say 25,000 plus. I actually have no idea how many cards I have. I definitely have 25,000 um, plus. It's probably quite a bit more than that because of I have so many duplicates. But I have basically, because of giving them all to my son, he has quite an extensive, extensive collection as well. And but I really enjoy uh, seeing his face light up when, whether he gets a really good pull or I do. And I always just give him the cards because um, I'm starting to realize that I do this more or less. Ooh, nice. Uh, I do this more or less because of his excitement. It doesn't do a lot for me anymore, but. Uh, I just absolutely love doing it with him, and it gives me something to uh, enjoy with him and collect. And I don't get to see him a lot because I travel a ton for work, but um, this is something that we share a common interest in, and it helps a lot in uh, when we talk on the phone and whatnot. So yeah, all right, here we go. Last card, is it some magic? Hey, that's pretty cool. All right, we got a Heatron V from the first one and then the second one so cool all right guys that is it uh, i hope you all enjoyed um and hey have a good day thanks for watching also i appreciate it and uh yeah take care